Welcome to Show Up and Glow. My name's Jalen. This is my cozy corner. A space created just for you to tune in and chill out. If this interests you, I invite you to find some headphones, a quiet space, and join me for a calming and comforting experience. If this is not for you, that is okay. I appreciate you stopping by. As you notice yourself enjoying your stay, please be sure to like and subscribe for more of this calm and cozy vibe. Now let's get started. We're gonna come back to a little page. We started coloring a couple videos back. And it's not gonna be a very chatty video today. Just want you to enjoy the sounds of the coloring book and the colored pencils on the paper. Really just allow yourself to relax into this moment. Allow your mind to shut off. Allow your body to be comfortable. And just breathe and relax. Sometimes that's all we need. And it can make a world of difference. So wherever you're at today, thank you so much for being with me. We're going to get right into it. And again, just find yourself, you know, doing a whole lot of nothing. Doing a whole lot of nothing. We're still working our way through Time to Huga. A joy and happiness coloring book. Cozy comfort. Here's where we left off. Nice little assortment of books with a teacup and a little plant. Little toy horse. So let's just get into it today and see how far we get.
always weird when your hand gets itchy. It's like, how? Why? Maybe it's the energy and vibration of the shaking of the colored pencil in my hand as I color. Maybe that's what it was doing. With so much social media today and devices and platforms that can keep our minds really busy, I find lately that the accounts that slow down my mind, slow down my scrolling, and make everything feel sleepy, remind me that I don't do it enough, you know, that I need to be slowing down so much more and that it feels so nice to slow down and relax for a little bit. So I hope by the end of this video, you too feel that nice relaxation and stillness after giving your mind a little break.
sometimes there's so many color options I just get stumped and I just I don't know what to do which color to choose just gotta go with your gut whatever color first comes to mind you just pick it up and, and roll with it any color is a good color Scratchy. A little scratchy sound on there. It's not good. really enjoyed coloring with colored pencils again. Kind of putting the markers behind me for now. It's just so satisfying. You just get into all the little nooks and crannies. Get a colored pencil and it feels just so like accomplished by the end.
my goodness. Can you imagine riding in a car like that? If it's that noisy on the outside, where do you think it's gonna be on the inside? I have a handful of different types of coloring books. For a while there, um, the only type of like grown up coloring books I could find were those, the only term I kind of know for it is like Zentangle. They're just kind of like coloring books with a lot of little tiny shapes that are in one big shape, so like I have one. That's birds, obviously. I'm gonna have a coloring book that's birds. And so it's like the shape of a bird, but like inside the bird is like a bunch of like scallop shapes or a bunch of triangle shapes or a bunch of squiggly shapes. And I like that, I liked those, but boy, they just are so tedious and to finish one page takes forever. And I get the point, it's meditative. But I've really loved this coloring book, and I would love to get more from this woman who made this. I mean, I should put them on my throne, because that's how I ended up getting this one. Because I just, I love that it's not so many tiny, there's tiny little details, but it's also like a big picture that you don't feel overwhelmed by. I just really, really enjoyed this coloring book. So thank you again to Anonymous, who gifted me this. If you're unfamiliar with Throne, I have it linked below in my bio. It's a platform where viewers like you can send creators like me gifts for free. I'm sorry. My brain is relaxed. It is mush. It is where you can send me gifts anonymously from my wish list and things on my wish list I like to incorporate into the cozy corner. Western Barbie came from Throne, as well as Bob Ross came from Throne, as well as the Wizard of Oz collectibles, as well as this coloring book and so many other things we've talked about. So if you're interested in that and you want to be a part of the channel in a different way, I greatly appreciate it. So we're almost done with, um, this where we're gonna stop but we didn't finish the entire page today that's just not gonna happen but I'll show you in the end what we did accomplish because we did accomplish a lot
mix it up for today. We completed two books at the top. Filled in the pages with the color. It's very nice. Looks a little, looks a little worn and old. And that's as far as we got today. But I love it. And I'll be honest, I do judge a book by its cover. I do judge a literal book by its cover when there's so many books in Barnes and Noble and you don't know where to start. You have to kind of just start picking up the covers that you like. And then I get online very quickly and then I read kind of an overview and of course I read the inside of a book or the back of the book to see if I'm going to like it and then if I don't I put it down. And then I'm on to the next book that I am judging by its cover. So. This is actually really fun to color these. Because I get to think like, hmm, what would someone pick up? What would interest someone? <clears throat> so, I hope you enjoyed our nice little quiet time together here today in the cozy corner. Thank you so, 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 so much for being here with me today. I'll see you again real soon.